Welcome to Silver Keep. I'm Brian Anderson coming to you from Anderson's Guitar Bar here in the lovely League City, Texas. Now take a look at uh, Dos uh, Lime and Salt, Salt Zero. Dos Equis, another another big name that's come out with a non-alcoholic. Gotta love it. Uh, Dos Equis, when I drank, uh, I drank a lot of Dos Equis Amber. I drank some Dos Equis as well. Dos Equis, it's a brand that I trusted that I really liked. And so I was really excited to see this. I didn't even know they were putting it out. Uh, then at one of my local grocery stores here, pops up. There it is. Great. Love it. I love when new stuff shows up. Yeah, you know, I, I love our non-alcoholic market where we've got great places like uh, Athletic Brewing. You got Bravis. You got all these companies just exclusively making non-alcoholics. But I do love it as well when the big name brands actually put a little investment into non-alcoholic, and I, you know, it's great. So we're gonna try this one out now. This is it is a uh, lime and salt, so it's got that in there. I tend to like to control my own destiny when it comes to things like adding salt and lime to beer. Uh, and so I never had the alcoholic version of this, so I can't really compare it to that. Uh, so we're just gonna have to com compare it to a, a regular Dos Equis with a, a lime, squeeze of lime and some salt in there. You smell it? It's got an interesting aroma to it. Um, and I I'll tell you, well, let's just taste it. When you taste it, you get the lime. Man, you get the lime right back. Really nice, well done lime. The salt to me, it almost has a gosa uh, uh, flavor to it, which means to me it's got a decent amount of salt in it. Uh, this is almost to me too much salt. Now, there's some people that really like to, to rim the heck out of their, their bottle or glass with salt. If you like that, or if you like gosas, uh, this is actually. <laughs> It's got that style of beer flavor to it. It's a bit much for me. Uh, the, the, the beer flavor is outstanding. I mean, it's really, really good. Um, and, and it's, I, I don't want to, this is not bad. This is, it's just, to me, I would have liked this if it had a touch less salt in it. The lime's perfect. Uh, and the, and the, the Secchi flavor is there. I mean, it's got that, the Secchi almost has a German feel to it. Uh, and uh, it's kind of got that crisp German uh, lager feel to it. It's just, it's it's a nice beer. Great looking. Um, the smell, uh, let me go back to the aroma. The aroma has kind of a ghost of smell to it. it, it and so that's, that was kind of interesting when I first smelled it, was it kind of had that that aroma to it to me, which the Germans make a great ghost of. Uh, and um, so, so that's what it is. And uh, I'm going to give this a four. Uh, because to me, I think that salt is a little overdone. That's my personal preference. You may give this a five, you may give it a two. Uh, but I'll tell you, it stays true to the Dos Equis flavor, and the lime is dead on. I like it. It's a good beer. I'm so Rocky. Live well, drink smart.